Good morning dear students today we will start with new chapter of your syllabus that is lesson number 3 parts of a computer it's on page number 22 what are parts of computer what are parts in your book example is given about body parts let's read it just as our body <clears throat> has different parts a computer also has different parts every part in our body has some specific functions to perform for example eyes are used to seeing hands are for writing legs for walking etc so in our body we have different parts and all parts has specific functions like uh, with the help of your hands you can write with the help of your legs you can run or walk with the help of your eyes you can able to you are able to see things around uh, around you similarly a computer also has different parts as you can see in 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 a picture now what are the names of these parts monitor mouse keyboard cpu let's have a look on them one by one for more understanding monitor keyboard CPU, mouse. I guess you all are now clear with the parts of computer. Next is it's on page number twenty three, functions of computer parts. Now you all know what are the names of the different parts of computer. Let's study. what are their functions first is monitor can you see the picture of monitor in your books what monitor is saying it looks like a television screen your television screen at home monitor looks like that it display everything you do on a computer whatever you do on computer monitor shows you it is used to display drawings words games cartoons etc next one is number 2 keyboard what is the use of it can you see the small buttons of a keyboard they are called keys you can see the picture of keyboard on on your screen and the small buttons on the keyboards they are called keys with the help of keyboard we can type words or numbers on the computer third one is c p u c p u c p u stands for central processing unit central processing unit it is the brain of the computer and it also control all the parts of a computer it do all types of calculations as well next is mouse don't compare it with the mouse in your house that eats your food and spoil things it is a computer mouse mouse have two buttons and a scroll wheel how many buttons 
two buttons. Mouse have two buttons. And a scroll wheel. Look at the picture here. You can see a small wheel between these the two buttons of mouse. That small wheel is known as scroll wheel. It is used to move the mouse pointer on the screen and it is also used for, the mo for moving the mouse pointer. Now what is mouse pointer? Look at the picture of arrow on your screen. You can see its picture in your book too. This small arrow on the screen is known as mouse pointer. So children, we are done with four main parts of computer that are monitor, keyboard, CPU and mouse. We will do additional devices, book exercise, question answer in our next sections now i want all of you to please watch one video related to your topic that is parts of computer for better understanding look rennie this is a computer clico the computer seems to have many parts in it. Yes, Rennie. A computer is made up of different parts. The monitor, the CPU, the keyboard and the mouse are four major parts of a computer. All these parts are very important. Please tell me how these parts are important for a computer. Sure, Rennie. Let's start with the monitor. The monitor has a screen and it looks like a TV. It displays the output whatever work is done or instruction is given on the screen. This board with alphabets and numbers on it is called a keyboard. The big and small buttons on it are called keys. Using these keys we can write letters. We can make reports and presentations and also play movies and songs. What is the CPU? It looks like a big box. The CPU is the central part of the computer. It is also called the brain of the computer. The CPU tells the computer what to do. What does CPU mean, Clicko? CPU stands for Central Processing Unit. It is the most important part of the computer. What does a CPU do in a computer, Clico? A CPU guides and helps the computer to perform different functions quickly and easily. The CPU is placed inside a box called the System Unit. What is this, Clico? It has a wire attached to it and if like a tail. It looks like a mouse. <laughs> it is a mouse, Rene. A mouse? How can it be? It is not a living thing. It is a computer mouse, Rene. Look, it has two buttons on it and a scroll wheel at the center. It also has a small ball on the bottom, which moves the mouse pointer on the screen. How does it help us, Clico? A mouse helps us to select any folder or content from the computer screen. For better movement, the mouse should be kept over a mouse pad. <laughs> 